Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's problem statement is to find out missing number in an given array. So there can be two possibility in this. There can be only one missing number or there can be multiple missing number in an given array. So we are going to find out what can be the best approach to solve this. Let's move forward. So let's talk about scenario when we have one missing number in an given array. So you can see over here we have an array 1, 2, 3, 5. So you can easily understand 4 is missing over here. So what sort of technique we can apply to find out? So there can be two techniques that we can use. One, we can try to solve this mathematically, then implement that the same thing in the code. And second is ZOR operation. So here we are going to solve it through mathematical equation. So guys, this is my array. You can see over here, four is missing. So what mathematical equation we are going to use to solve this? So guys, you might have heard about this formula, which is sum of n natural number. So this formula we are going to use. Here, n is 5. And how it is? So, you have here 1, 2, 3, 5, 4 element. And there is one element which is missing. So, total 5 element. So, by that, we have n is 5. Next thing is that we are going to find out sum of all these numbers. So, we will take one result. So, if you sum up all these numbers, you will get the result 11 okay now the final thing is that we are going to subtract 11 from 15 so result is subtracted from sum of natural number and you will get your missing number that is 4 so this is the simplest approach i feel we are going to use so we are in my ide we have an array you can see here 9 is missing we are going to call this missing number over here so here we are going to write out the logic of our missing number so same like as i shown you in the concept we are going to calculate sum of n natural number then we have one result 0 then in this result i am going to find out sum of all number in the given array so i am taking this loop so here in the result i have all the sum at this point I am going to subtract the result from sum of number. So I'll get the missing number. Let me show you. So I'm going to run this program. So you can see we have found out the missing number. Since in this scenario I'm going to iterate this for n number of times, so time complexity is O n and we are not going to use any extra space. So space complexity is O1. So this was my first case where I tried to find out uh, one missing number here. So now moving to case 2 where we have multiple missing number in the given array. So here is the example 1, 1, 2, 2, 3, 4 is missing here and 6 is missing here, 8 is missing here. So in this case we have a lot of duplicates and a lot of missing numbers so what can be the best solution to solve this so there can be multiple ways to solve this but i always feel that we should solve it in a way which we can relate it to our day-to-day -day life so that we can remember it for longer time i think you all are familiar with these keywords roll call and attendance mark this takes back to the school uh, every morning our teacher used to uh, carry one register with her and in that register she used to maintain all those records whoever is present and whoever is absent so same approach we are going to see here to find out the missing number let's see so coming to my id we have multiple missing number class where we have main method then as per the problem statement we have this array where we have multiple missing number then just like the concept we are going to maintain one register array having length same as that of array next thing that is 
important to notice by default all these indexes will be containing zero so when i'm iterating through this array wherever i find the record it will store one so that means if it does not find a given number it will be storing only zero same thing i'm checking over here when i'm iterating again that if it has zero we are going to print that number so that's how we are going to find out the missing number so let me run this program and show you so you can see over here four six eight for missing over here you can cross check four is missing six is missing and eight is missing so we are able to find out that through this roll call approach now next important thing time and space complexity so here space complexity is o n why because we are taking one new register array to store the n element and their count similarly time complexity is o n plus o n that is o to n and why it is because we are iterating here for two times one is here and again we are iterating this register so that's how uh, it is solved so thank you guys please like and subscribe for such videos and please let me know if you have any doubt in the comment section i'll try to resolve this thank you